you? I see you. Looking at me? What do you see out there? Hmm? What do you see out there? Telling me? Who's out there? Who is it? Who's out there? Hmm, I don't know about that. crocheting my doily I will have to uh, wash it and then I will have to block it then it'll dry and then I can uh, get it ready for shipping so I can I let water get warm and then uh, I get it turned around so that and then I just uh, add a spurt or two of uh, on this soap that seems to be working really good for me and then I just really vigorously wash it and let the soap really saturate the fibers. I tried a lot of uh, you know uh, items to uh, stiffen them or shape them up and uh, none works as good as uh, as Don Disco, believe it or not. So I will uh, rinse it out and leave a little bit, just a little bit of residue left in there. I don't know if you can see it or not, but uh, that's enough to uh, give it a light starchy effect. Then I will take a uh, clean towel and I will lay the wet doily on it and I roll it up to uh, get some of the excess moisture out of the doily. I really, really like this uh, locking board. Uh, it uh, makes things so much easier, easier for me. Um, each one of those little squares is an inch. So that makes it really simple. This doily is supposed to be a 7 inch by 12 inch. So I put my first pin at this mark here. Then I count 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I put another pin over here. Then I count 12 going this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, which will be right here. And the last corner here. Is This one I want. Okay. Thank you for watching my short video. If you like to purchase this or other of my handmade doilies, please visit my online shop linked in the description below. Your support is greatly appreciated. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.